Hi everybody, my name is Mark Bates. I gotta start off by saying, I am awful on camera. So I hope this isn't too bad. Because it's a very good thing. The good thing that we're doing is awarding the Spartan Cup. The Spartan Cup is a recognition of commitment and service to the students and our school community. What makes the Spartan Cup special is that it's awarded by an individual person, the last winner of the Spartan Cup, to a new Spartan Cup holder each year. For eight years, it's been awarded in the presence of peers. The extraordinary times we're living in requires this to be done in a different way. And I want to thank Sheila Fisher for adapting and changing to keep this tradition alive. Hello fellow Spartans, happy end of the school year. And what a crazy year it was, right? It's wonderful that the relatively new tradition of the Spartan Cup is going to continue this year, even though we can't all be together to celebrate the end of the school year and the Spartan Cup. During my 22 years as a full-time teacher and 10 years of being a Spartan of all trades, I have known and worked with many staff members who embody what I consider true Spartan spirit. I believe that recipients of this cup that honors the Spartan spirit should be masters of their craft, no matter what their role is in the district. Hopefully they are people who continually strive to be and do better. Their number one priority is the students, but they also work with and support staff. This Spartan always asks, what can I do to best support students? And no matter what else is going on, they maintain that focus on student success. These Spartans accept the whole child, recognizing each one's gifts, their strengths, their struggles, that they are an individual, but still looking at the whole child. They try to make connections with students and find ways to help them achieve their academic success. But on the other hand, they keep trying to nurture their growth as caring and responsible human beings. I believe this year's recipient of the Spartan Cup consistently meets all these challenges head on, exemplifying the meaning of true Spartan, supporting each student with love and kindness. Congratulations. To say that the 2019-2020 school year has been a challenge is putting it lightly. The Spartan Cup nominee has had more challenges than most. Yet, this person has the ability to greet everyone with kindness, with a smile on their face. This person makes an extreme effort to connect with all of their students. This person, I believe, has pictures of probably 85% of the students that the person has ever taught and probably 85% of the staff that this person has ever worked with. On special occasions like birthdays or anniversaries or, or even the birth of a child of a former student, this Spartan Cup nominee makes sure that they recognize and reach out to the special person and share their thoughts and their their kindness. They just go above and beyond and continue to do it through thick and thin. Congratulations the to the 2019-2020 Spartan Cup nominee. I feel the Spartan Cup should go to somebody who is always looking to make learning fun um, and always looking to see how they can incorporate games and activities into their teaching uh, and so their students really enjoy learning. What the Spartan Cup means to me is first of all it needs to be given to a real Spartan. Uh, someone who loves purple and gold. Someone who is dedicated to the students and the staff of SOTUS. Who is special, is special to the school. Um, I don't know, and someone I guess who's who's had a an outstanding or you know 
a great year. So that's what the Spartan Cup means to me. I think the winner of this year's Spartan Cup should be somebody who is a friend to everybody, somebody who's compassionate towards students and colleagues, and somebody who is just relentless. And, and I mean that in the best sense of the word. I mean somebody who doesn't let anything stand in the way of them planning for and executing instruction and just getting stuff done and just nothing getting in the way of that. I think that's the kind of person who deserves a Spartan Cup this year. I believe the Spartan Cup should uh, go to someone that embodies all of the attributes that the um, Paper Plate Awards represents. Um, I think the person should be all of those things rolled into one. Um, well, most of them, maybe not all of them, but things like they should have a great sense of humor. They should be a busy bee. Uh, they should have a heart of gold. They should be a good dancer. They should have a great smile, a great laugh. They should light up the room. Uh, they should see the positive in all situations. Even at some point, if we had did paper plate awards years ago, they would have been the rookie of the year, something like that. Uh, but, uh, you don't have to be everything. So maybe you don't have to be affable. Um, what, what is affable again? Anybody? What's affable? I think that the Spartan Cup should be awarded to someone who is thoughtful and considerate of others and is a fantastic cheerleader for uh, the benefit of other people. I believe the person who should get the Spartan Cup Award is someone who is always there for their friends. I believe the Spartan Cup Award should go to a person who does it all with no holds barred. This person sacrifices without end and without thought. More so even without complaint, ever. She's a teacher's teacher. She does her own work masterfully and helps others whenever she can. If volunteers are needed, she's there 100%. For her students, the sky's the limit. There's nothing she wouldn't and doesn't do for them. And did I mention team player? Those are her middle names. And whether you're on a team in her class or a team on the field, you're there forever. And she'll memorialize you forever. I could go on forever about why this person deserves the Spartan Cup Award, but not without giving it away. Love you dearly, dear Spartan. This is a teacher who I have nothing but the deepest respect for, and a person who has inspired me not just professionally, but personally. When I think of the Spartan Cup, recipient. I think of someone that has remained positive in spite of everything that has been going on in their life, both personal and professional. I think of all the things this person has done for their students. This has been an extremely difficult year and this person has remained positive in spite of everything. At this point, I can honestly say there's no one more deserving of this award and congratulations. Thank you. I'm so excited about this year's Spartan Cup recipient. She's an amazing teacher and has embraced technology even though she's been teaching basically the same subject for years. She's got a positive attitude even when life drops the sourest lemons, she somehow makes the sweetest lemonade. She's a good friend and leader to staff and students and loves to share her enthusiasm for everything. This woman inspires me to be a better person and a better staff member, and I hope to work with her and learn from her for many more years. Congratulations. Well, there are many characteristics that uh, I would certainly look for in the Spartan Club Award. There are a few that come to mind. Someone who deeply cares about the children of SOTUS and who always puts them before anyone else somebody who is endlessly positive and sees the good in all people, all children, and always looks for positives in any situation. 
and somebody who just deeply cares for all of those around them, who does their best to lift other people up, even when in their own lives they might be struggling or have struggles that none of us even realize. So when I think about who this Spartan Cup Award is going to, it's pretty gosh darn special. And I just want to congratulate that person, very well deserved, and someone that I am so proud um, that is a member of the SOTUS family. This person is the epitome of dedication and positive attitude. I can't recall a time this person wouldn't go out of their way to help a coworker, a student, a friend, or an athlete. I've had the great honor of spending a lot of time with this person over the years and in many aspects of my life whether at school, at work, whether at a personal gathering, either way, we always had an amazing time and there was never a dull moment. Some of my best memories though were definitely on the field or on the court. This person was not only a coach to my children, but a coach to me. They're a role model and the perfect example of what true dedication and leadership are and should look like. My grown children who have had the opportunity to learn and grow with this person still inquire about their well-being. My youngest asks often if she too will get to learn from this person in the classroom or on the field or on the court. This says a lot about how amazing this year's recipient is. If you take into consideration my children are 28, 21, and 14, that's quite a span of ages to inspire. This year's recipient does just that, inspires. Inspires everyone they teach, everyone they work with, and everyone they coach to be their best. I can't imagine a better choice for this year's Spartan Cup Award. Congratulations, my friend. You are most deserving. When I think of the qualities of the Spartan Cup recipient, I come up with three requirements. Number one, it's someone who has the ability to develop relationships with not only staff, but students. Number two, it's someone who is patient, caring, and kind. And number three, it's someone who is dedicated to their job. This year's recipient meets all of these requirements and is someone I am so lucky to have in my life as a Spartan, as a friend, and as a family member. When Brian gave me the Spartan Cup last year, I was so humbled and surprised, to be honest. The one year that I wasn't even there and I was awarded with the best Spartan of the year, if you will. I'd watched my colleagues get this award for the past seven years, and I always thought, if I ever win the Spartan Cup, who would I give it to? This was probably the easiest choice I have ever made. Linda, you are patient, you are devoted, and you are selfless beyond words. What you have gone through and what you continue to go through this year is enough to break the strongest of people, yet you showed up every day. And you showed up with a smile on your face, ready to go. Even on the days that you took off, you still showed up. You spent countless hours creating video lessons on weekends and weeknights when most others would be doing anything but school-related work especially considering you were already off and had coverage and substitutes that could handle this for you. You had strong sub coverage as well that you easily could have walked away from and let take over, but because of your selflessness and your devotion, you continued to show up and you made sure that everything went well and that your kids and your students were taken care of. You were so committed to all of your fellow Spartans, both staff and students, you never miss a birthday, an anniversary, a celebration. You have pictures for every event. And you, even when you are dealing with your own family crisis, you make sure to stop and celebrate the good in the lives around you. That takes a truly special person. The three words that I chose to add to the Spartan Cup to honor my friend Linda Falks are patient. Your patience is unwavering. I've never seen you lose your cool. Okay, well, maybe on the softball field. Devoted. You are devoted to your work, your athletes, your coworkers, your friends, but most of all, your family. Your devotion to your family is written all over your face, Linda. It's almost as large as the devotion to the, your devotion to the dolphins. You're selfless. You are generous beyond words. 
You've given to others without looking for anything in return countless times. You have a great capacity to love others and you express it. You do not judge. You understand your love and you for others and you embrace it time and time again. Linda, you are the most devoted Spartan and the most deserving that I can imagine handing this cup over to. Please enjoy this title and know that all of your friends and coworkers felt that this is so deserved. You are an amazing teacher, coach, friend, mother, and wife. Those of us who are lucky enough to have you in our lives are so very blessed. Congratulations, my dear friend.